Welcome back to Undertale. In the last part, we finally had our long-awaited battle with Asgore, but as it turns out, Asgore did not really want to kill us, and we didn't kill him either. So instead, Flowey killed him. <laughs> yeah, Flowey, Flowey ended up killing Asgore, and then we had a battle with Flowey, which was just absolutely terrifying. I still don't know how I managed to defeat Flowey on my first attempt, but I don't know, that was, that was amazing how I managed to pull that off. However, according to Flowey, we did not get the true ending to the pacifist run by defeating him. Apparently, there's still some more stuff that we have to do before we can get the true ending to the pacifist run. And one of the things he told us to do is to reload our save file and go and see Alphys first. Which is what we are going to do. So as you can see, we are at the end, and we could go through that room again and battle Asgore, but instead, we're gonna go back, and we're gonna go and see Elphiz. Okay, someone's calling me. Hey, uh, this is Undyne. Shut up, Papyrus. This was your idea. Human, you have to deliver something for me. Uh, please? I'm at Snowden in front of Papyrus's. See ya, punk. Okay. I was trying to make it back to Elphiz's lab, but apparently I need to deliver something to Undyne. Oh, okay then. So yeah, we're just gonna... We're just gonna go back here. Yeah, Sans is not here anymore. Alright, well I guess we'll go back to Snowden. Actually... The River Man. Or the River Woman. Now, maybe... Maybe he or she will take me back to Snowden Town. How about we actually try riding in the boat this time? Where will we go today? Oh, okay, I can go back to Snowden. Well, in that case, let's go to Snowden first. This will take a shorter amount of time here. Tra la la. Hmm. I should have worn a few million more pairs of pants today. Okay, here we go. Yep, we're back in Snowden. So we need to go to Papyrus's house. Come again sometime. Okay, wait, is, is he still gonna be here? Yeah, okay. Or he or she, whatever. Alright, well, it's been a while since we've been in Snowden, but... Need to go see, uh, Undyne here. How you doing? Hey, I have something to give you, but you're carrying way too much. Oh. Well, that can be easily fixed. How would I actually try using one of the dimensional boxes? I haven't even tried using this yet. Alright, how would I just put one of my star fates in here? Or actually, better yet, how about I put a, a few of them in there? Alright. Um, so, I have a favor to ask you. Uh, I, I need you to deliver this letter to Dr. Elphiz. Huh? Why don't I do it myself? Um, well, it's kind of personal, but we're friends, so I'll t tell you. Hotland sucks! I don't want to have to go over there. So here you go. You got the, you got the Undyne's letter. Wow, good grammar. <laughs> oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so much. You're the best. Okay. Undyne writes a lot of letters, but she can never seem to find the right words. So when she goes to deliver them herself, she always quits so she can go back and rewrite. That's why she asked you. Because you have no standards. <laughs> okay then. Well, I guess we'll go and deliver that letter to Elphiz. Back to Hotland we go. Okay, what the- oh, oh, alright. Um... <laughs> the riverboat is- is now a cat just running across the water. Temi Village. The room before the darkening lantern room. Yeah, what about it? <laughs> I've already been to Temi Village, I really don't think I need to go back there for anything. So, okay, come again sometime. Alright, so let's go and deliver that letter. How about I just save quickly? Why not? There we go. Okay, let's go deliver that letter then. Wait, the door has no mail slot? Slide the letter under. Uh, sure. You slide the letter under the door and give it a knock. Uh, oh, n no, is that another letter? I don't want to open it. C can I just slide it back out? N no, I, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Um, it it's shut kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. What in the world was that noise? How you doing? Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god! Did you write this letter? 
it wasn't Zion, so I had no idea who could have... Oh my god. Oh no. That's adorable. And I, I had no idea you uh, wrote that way. Actually, Un Undyne wrote it. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I did. I don't really deserve to be forgiven. Much less, um... This? And so passionately, too. You know what? Okay, I'll do it! It's the least I can do to make it up to you. Y yeah Let's go on a date! Oh, okay, we're dating Elphas now? I guess we are, okay. But Undyne's the one- oh, dating start. But wait a second, Undyne was the one who wrote the letter, so does that mean- Does that mean- Oh. Oh. Okay then. Alright. Alrighty then. Um, so, Un Undyne appears to have, uh, I think she's in love, guys. I think she's in love. Anyway, uh, sorry, I'm still getting dressed. H how do I look? My friend helped me pick out this dress. She's got a great sense of, um, anyway, let's do this thing. Alright, now we really, we really start. H hey, wait! Actually, we still can't start the date yet. Dating stop? <laughs> okay, we're breaking the fourth wall now. Um, I've got to give you items to raise your affection statistic first. That'll increase the chance of a successful outcome to the date. Right? Anyway, don't worry, I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for a date like this. F first, I've got... some metal armor polish. Um, maybe you can't use that. But... I also brought some waterproof cream for your scales. Your, uh, scales? Uh, well, how about this magical spear repair kit that I, um, hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date, okay? I think Elphis might have something for Undyne as well. Alright, dating start. Yeah, let's, uh, date. Let's go? Uh, okay, I can't do anything. Wait, what's- what's going on? Uh... Do you... Like... Anime? <laughs> well, there's not a lot of- I don't really watch a lot of anime, but just to make Elphus happy, yeah. Hey, me too! I mean, I don't want to ruin the date or anything, so I might as well just say yes to all her questions. Hey, let's... Go somewhere! But where's a good place to go on a date? I've got it! Let's go to the garbage dump! Wow, great place for a date. <laughs> here we are! This is where Undyne and I come all the time. We find all sorts of great stuff here. Heh, <laughs> she's really... Uh... Oh no. That's her over there! I, I can't let her see me on a date with you! Why? Because... Uh... Well... Oh no, here she comes! She's hiding behind the garbage can. Oh, hello. Hey, there you are! I... Uh... Realized if you deliver that thing... It might be a bad idea. So, I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Huh? You don't have it? Yeah. Have you at least seen her? Uh, 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 well, do I, do I, do I want to give her away? Uh, uh, mm, mm, uh, mm, uh, 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 nope, I haven't seen her at all. No. But she wasn't at home. Where the heck could she be? Oh, wait, she's gone. Oh, my God. Well, I guess it's obvious, huh? I, um... I really like her. I mean, more than I like other people. I'm sorry. I just figured, y you know, it'd be fun to go on a, like, a cute kind of pretend date with you? To, to make you feel better? Well, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. I'm sorry, I messed up again. Undyne's the person I, um, really want to go on a date with. But, I mean, she's way out of my league. Not that you aren't, uh, cool. But, but Undyne, she's so confident and strong and funny. And I'm just a nobody, a fraud. I'm the royal scientist, but all I've ever done is hurt people. I've told her so many lies. She thinks I'm... She, she thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. If she gets close to me, she'll... She'll find out the truth about me. What should I do? Oh, I have to give her advice, which, oh, I am not even good at doing that in real life. Oh, huh. Tell her the truth or keep lying. Eh, you know what, just, just tell her the truth. Be honest with her. 
the truth. But if I tell her that, she'll hate me. Isn't it better this way? To live a lie where both people are happy? Or a truth where neither of us are? They say, be yourself. But I don't really like who myself is. I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. <laughs> it's not a good way to live your life. No, you're right. Every day I'm scared. Scared what will happen if people learn the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me. But how can I tell Undyne the tr truth? I d don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up. How can I practice? Uh... Let's roleplay it, or obviously let's roleplay. Okay, obviously just sounds rude. How about we roleplay it? Roleplay? That actually sounds kind of fun. Okay, which one of us will be Undyne? Uh... I can be Undyne, I guess. <laughs> I don't know where this is going. Oh, right, obviously. <laughs> Ahem. Hi, Undyne. How are you doing today? Okay, um, I'm... I could say I'm fine or you're cute. You know what? Just say I'm fine. Ha <laughs> ha! Glad to hear it. Uh, so I'd like to uh talk to you about something. Then she kisses you. <laughs> no, what is it, Elfiz? Um, you see, I, I, I haven't been exactly truthful with you. Y you see, I, I. Oh, forget it. Undyne. I... I want to tell you how I feel. You're so brave and strong and nice. Y you always listen to me when I talk about n nerdy stuff. Y you always do your best to make me feel special. Like like, like telling me that y you'll beat anyone up that gets in my way. Undyne! I can't take this any longer! I'm madly in love with you! Hold me, Undyne! Hold me! Wait, what? What did you just say? Wait, she, she heard that the whole time? Uh, I'm dying. I was just... Hey, whoa, wait a second. Your outfit's really cute. What's the occasion? Wait a second. Are you two... on a date? Not a real one? Uh, yes! I, I mean, uh, uh, no! I mean, we were, but I, I mean, actually, we were only romantically role-playing as you. What? I mean, uh, I mean... Undyne, I... I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well... Everything. I told you that seaweed was, like, scientifically important. Really, I just want to use it to make ice cream. Those human history books I keep reading, those are just dorky comic books. And the history movies, those... Those are just, uh, anime. They aren't real. And that time I told you I was busy with work on the phone, I was just eating frozen yogurt in my pajamas. That time I... Elf is... I... I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool, that I wasn't some... nerdy loser. Elphiz. Undyne, I... I really think you're neat, okay? Elphiz. Shh. <laughs> going... A what? <laughs> okay, then! Nice three-pointer. Elphiz, I think you're neat too, I guess. But you've got to realize, most of what you said really doesn't matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all of that stuff is just nerdy crap. What I like about you is that you're passionate, you're analytical, it doesn't matter what it is, you care about it. 100% at maximum power! So, you don't have to lie to me. I don't want you to have to lie to anyone anymore. Elphiz, I want to help you become happy with who you are. And I know just the training you need to do that. Undyne, you... You're gonna train me? <laughs> what? Me? Ah, <laughs> Papyrus. Wait, what does it say on, it, on, his, on his outfit? Uh... I... Okay, Jog... Jog boy or Jog Lord? What the heck? Nah, I'm gonna get Papyrus to do it. Get those bones shaken! It's time to jog 100 laps, hooting about how great we are. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. I'm dying. I'll do my best. Okay. Oh my god! She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics, those are still real, right? Anime's real, right? 
<laughs> yeah. Oh, 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 okay. Why is the music going so fast? Oh, do, do I tell her truth or do I... Well, I mean, the anime's technically not real, but... Oh, 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 uh, 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 I don't want Undyne to kill me, so I'll just say yes. Ha ha ha. I knew it. Gigantic swords. Magical princesses. Here I come. Uh, thanks for taking care of Alphas. I didn't get to say what I wanted to, but... Things seem like they're going to get better for her. Well, I gotta go catch up with them. Later. Oh, wait a second, what? Why am I back here? Oh, maybe this is where Elphys took me. Oh, this is the garbage. Okay, yeah, this must have been where Elphys took me on, on the date. Okay, that's why I'm back here. Yeah, because this is the garbage dump in Waterfall. Yeah. Yeah, the trash zone. Okay, that's why I'm back here. Well, that was that was interesting. Apparently, <laughs> Fist really loves on dying. Um. Okay then. Well, uh, is the mad dump? No, the mad dummy's not here. But I'm getting. Okay, Papyrus is calling me. Howdy! If it isn't my good friend who trusts me, this is Papyrus. You're also a mutual friend. Alphas and I finished our training early, very early. So I sent her home, very home. Uh, now. I feel strongly and for no apparent reason. You should also go... there. To her lab... house. I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye! Okay, so we need to go back to Elf's lab, it seems. We are back in the quiet area now. I wonder, is Undyne's house still on fire, out of curiosity? Yep, that's... that is a yes, that is a definite yes. <laughs> her house is still on fire, the dummy is still here though. What about Napstablook? Napstablook's probably still in his house, yeah, listening to music. Are you still working on your mix? Yeah, he's still working on his on his new mix. Still hasn't finished that, apparently. Well, alright then. I guess we'll go back to Elphys' lab now. Out of curiosity, I decided to go back to Temi Village, and apparently the Temi armor is only 1800 gold now. I wonder if that's because of all the times I purposely died. Uh, tr while, uh, fighting Asgore just to see if, uh, his dialogue would change. If I could get him to stop fighting. That's probably why. So, yeah, because I believe the Temi armor is supposed to lower in price if, uh, you die a lot in the game, so... And I think because of all the die the times I, I died on purpose to Asgore just to see if his dialogue would change whenever I would, uh, try talking to him. Yeah, that must be why. Temi lowered the price a lot. I still don't feel like I need it, though. Because what's my defense looking like right now? 15? It's good. I defend my- I have good enough defense for now, so I really don't need it. Alright, we made it back to Elphys' lab. Here we go, can we get in now? Yep, it opens. Let's see what we can do here. Let's see. Uh... Normal music's not, uh, playing here, though. Just some ambience. Wait, what? That door just opened on its own. What does this say? It's a note from Elphiz. Read it? Sure. It's hard to read because of the handwriting, but you try your best. Hey, thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really means a lot to me. But, as difficult as it is to say this, you guys alone can't magically make my own problems go away. I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore, and for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I'm going to start doing that now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But if you don't ever hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door to the north of this note. You all at least deserve to know what I did. That's all she wrote. Okay. Alrighty then. Um... Real quickly, I get that one last star fate out of here. Let's get all my star fates back. Okay, um, I guess we'll go down and see what she's done. Okay, things are getting kind of creepy here, but let's let's see. Wh what what's happening? Warning, warning! Elevator losing power. Okay, well, M, M, M tether stability lost. Okay, well, altitude dropping. Okay, well, I'm gonna die. Am I dead? Yeah, well, the elevator crashed. Um... <laughs> okay, then! Oh. Oh. 
This, what the heck is this place? Okay. There is only ambience. Also, the style changed. Entry number one. This is it. Time to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. Entry number two. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be derived from what was once living. So to create more, we will have to use what we have now. The souls of monsters. Okay... Entry number three. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require incredible power. Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the soul's host. And, unlike the persistent souls of humans, the souls of most monsters disappear immediately upon death. If only I could make a monster's soul last. Entry number five. I've done it. Oh wait, I think I... Did I go past one of, one of the entries? Using the blueprints, I've extracted it from the human souls. I believe this is what gives their souls the strength to persist after death. The will to keep living. The resolve to change fate. Let's call this power... Determination. Okay, wait, was this... Okay, no! There, there was no entry number four, actually. So, what happened to the fourth one? Okay! Weird things are happening- Oh. This ambience. Oh, we do have a- have a save. Save right here. Oh, the true laboratory. Oh, and it doesn't say you're filled with determination either. Okay. I do like this music, though. There appears to be a note on the ground right here. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Elevator. Lost power. Enter the center door. That's all you could read. Power room. Okay. Uh... Buy chips for 25G. Uh... No. Well, actually, I could. Uh... Okay, actually, hang on. Maybe I will. How about I put this in my, uh, dimensional box? Yeah, sure, why not? The vending machine dispensed some chisps. Okay. Papado chisps. Okay, what is this? Info heals 13 HP. Oh. That sounds pretty good, actually. Um... Okay, well, hang on a second here. I'm gonna- I'm gonna do some stuff. Well, actually... Well, do I do have the other, uh, dimensional box that I can- that I can put stuff in. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm fine with all my star fates for now. I think I have enough healing items, to be honest. So, I'm not gonna purchase any more for now. Alright, anyway, let's, uh, let's check this door. Okay. Guess this door is not going to open. Yeah, the door- the door doesn't open. This door also doesn't open, so I guess we have to go this way. Alright, let's start going to the left first. Let's read this. Entry number six. Asgore asked everyone outside the city for monsters that had fallen down. Their bodies came in today. They're still comatose, and soon, they'll all turn into dust. But what happens if I inject determination into them? If their souls persist after they perish, then... Freedom might be closer than we all thought. Okay. Okay, it's getting a little foggy in here now. Entry number nine. Wait, it just- it just- it just goes straight to entry number nine. Things aren't going well. None of the bodies have turned into dust, so I can't get the souls. I told the families that I would give them the dust back for the funerals. People are starting to ask me what's happening. What do I do? Okay, this is- this is starting to get grim now. It's some kind of operating table. It's sticky. Oh my. Um... Okay. Things are getting really weird here. Sinks? You turned on the sink. Okay. Uh... What? What? What is going on here? Oh. Hello, buddy. How you doing? Okay. I guess we have a boss fight. Blank drew near. Okay. Doesn't tell you their names? Okay. How are you guys doing? Check item stat cell? Oh, wait, it's just my... Wait a second, what? This is just my, uh... Items? But your inventory was full. Oh, uh... uh, uh okay. Alright. Interesting. 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 What is happening right now? But nobody came. Okay. Uh, what do you mean, but nobody came? Um... I can't- I can't flee from these guys, so... Okay... Stat? 
Attack 25, defense 25. Okay, what exactly is going on? Holy jeez. These guys are fast and furious. But nobody came. Uh... Alright, what about cell? You take out your cell phone, you can hear voices through the receiver. Come join the fun! I ain't joining any of your fun. No, forget that noise. Forget that noise! Ow. Oh, oh god, I... Why did I lose focus of the window there? Okay, hang on a second. I need to... I need to heal here. Holy jeez. What is going on? Lorem Ipsum Ducket, come join the fun. Become one of us. Nope. I ain't doing that. Ain't doing that. Nope. I don't want it. I don't want anything you're selling. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay. Smells like batteries. Oh, memory head. No, I, I'll refuse. I don't want to join you. Be seeing you. Okay. So how do I... Oh, jeez. They're so fast, though. They're really fast. Let me just stay in the corner and cry. Seems like it doesn't care anymore. That's it. There's a red key lying in the sink. You took it and put it on your keychain. Oh, okay, that might open the other door now. Because that door was red, wasn't it? Or... There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Drain dropped it. That's all you could read. Click. The red key fits perfectly into the slot. Oh, okay, I put that in there. Well, maybe that other door will open now. Because that other door had a had a red thing on it. Hang on a second. This This door all the way back over here. Oh yeah, that one's lighted now, and yeah, that that one should open. Yeah, it it's it's lighted now, so that should should be. Here we go. Okay, just take my uh, potato chips out of here. I can just come back and buy some more. The only thing is that it's not gonna. The enemies don't seem to give me more gold, but whatever. All right, let's keep going down this hallway here. Entry number twelve. Nothing is happening. I don't know what to do. I'll just keep injecting everything with determination. I want this to work. Entry number 13. One of the bodies opened its eyes. Oh. Looks like the determination's starting to work. What is this? It's an empty dog food bowl. Seems like a comfortable bed. Lie on it. Uh, do I want to do that? I don't... I don't know if I want to. Not, not just yet. Let me look around for a little bit. The clock's broken. Oh, there's another save point here, entry number 14. Everyone that had fallen down has woken up. They're all walking around and talking like nothing is wrong. I thought they were goners. Okay, another save. True Lab, the bedroom. Okay, there's, uh, more stuff in here, okay. Well, maybe... Well, I... <laughs> I have a feeling something bad's gonna happen if I lie down on the bed. I guess? Oh. Something gonna happen? Yep. How you doing? What is that? Uh... Okay. Hang on a second. There's, there's like a tentacle that appears. What is that? Hang on. Yeah, there's this thing. Does, does this thing do anything if I wait? Uh, yeah, it is. De it's definitely doing something. Uh... Am I gonna die if, if this thing touches me, or... Also, the placement of that thing right there is... Wait, actually. Uh... Oh. Okay, it just tucks me in the bed. Alright. Well, that's... is creepy. Oh. Okay, anyway. Let's, uh, try going down here. Entry number 15. Seems like this research was a dead end. But at least we got a happy ending out of it. I sent the souls in the vessel back to Asgore, and I called all the families and told them everyone's alive. I'll send everyone back tomorrow. Happy face. Entry number 16. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Bad things happening? Yeah, bad things are starting to happen. You just said no. Many times. Oh. Oh, looks like someone's taking a shower in there. How about N-O-No? -no? Oh, how about N-O-No -no to that either? Which direction do I go first, though? Ah, oh, forget it. Oh, wait, I just... I just move very slowly towards it. Uh... Oh, it's getting faster. Oh, why is it getting faster? Hello. Oh, it's a green key. Okay. Alright, well, I got the green key. That's good. So how about I, uh... Go and put in whichever 
wherever the green slot is, I guess. How about I save quickly? What if I go down this way? Uh, there's more stuff down here. Got mirrors and everything. Oh, this is entry number seven. We'll need a vessel to wield the monster souls when the time comes. After all, a monster cannot absorb the souls of other monsters, just as a human cannot absorb a human soul. So then, what about something that's neither human nor monster? Entry number 10. Experiments on the vessel are a failure. It doesn't seem to be any different from the control cases. Whatever. They're a hassle to work with anyway. The seeds just stick to you and won't let go. Okay. Bunch of mirrors. Oh, hello. What? That's a smiley face. Oh, boy. Okay, got another guy here. What the heck? There's just a comma. What are you? What is this monstrosity? Pick on, mystify, clean, hum, or pray. Uh, uh, okay, well, I'm not gonna pick on it. Mystify? You did something mysterious. Blank recognizes it has more to learn from this world. Uh, okay, I don't know what he's, what he's saying. What, what are you? What are you? What are you? I don't know what you are. But you're doing something. Butterflies are attacking your face. Why? I don't, what? Excuse me? C c hum? You hum a familiar tune, but no one heard you. Last look. Oh, 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 no, it's coming towards me. Oh, it's coming towards me. Oh, why is it coming towards me? Ow. Get away from me, please. Okay. I don't want it. I don't want it. Pray. You kneel and pray for safety. Remembers its conscience. Oh. Remembers its conscience. Oh, okay. It's just throwing its heads at me now. Okay, well, this is getting weird. This is getting weird. Uh, what is this music, too? What in the world is going on? Uh, pray again? But he already remembered his conscience. Okay. So now it just, it just attacks me with butterflies. What in the heck is going on here? What is this creature? Clean? You wash your hands, nothing happened. Okay. He's attacking me with his head now. With, with his multiple heads. Okay, how do I... So how exactly do I do I spare you then? I don't want to pick on you. Mystify? It was already mystified. Okay, maybe I do need to pick on it. That's mean though. I might as well try it anyway just to see what happens. Pick on. You pick on Reaper Bird? Reaper Bird seems to remember something. Someone finally gets it. Courage, ribbit, ribbit. Oh, wait a second. Is this like a some sort of chimera that fused together with other monsters? What the heck is happening? I don't know what this is. Reaper Bird seems placated. Okay, spare it, please. It just got flattened. Okay, well, that was just terrifying. Oh, wait, this is the thing for the blue key. Yeah, this is for the blue. You can't make it all out. Cold? That's all you could read. Okay. Well, at least I got rid of that guy, so... Okay, so that's that's the, the blue slot. I need to find the green slot, though. I do have the green key. Let me just save again. There we go. How about I try going this way? Try going to the right. Maybe the green slot's over here. Oh, what is happening? What is this? Entry number 11? Now that Metaton's made it big, he never talks to me anymore. Except to ask when I'm gonna finish his body. But I'm afraid if I finish his body, he won't need me anymore. And we'll never be friends ever again. Not to mention, every time I try to work on it, I just get really sweaty. Alright. Bunch of fans. Do I want to turn this on? Sure. What does that do exactly? Oh, it blows all the fog away. Oh, and there's another, there's another guy here. Alright, bring it on. Bring it on. I'm ready for you. Oh, 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 oh no. What do I do? Oh god, what do I do? Oh jeez, I can't turn it off. I'm tr I'm stuck. Oh, oh no. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna glitch out, I guess. I don't see anything. I don't see anything. I don't see anything. Okay. It's the amalgamate. Okay. Pet, beck and play or ignore. Oh, Jesus, music. <laughs> pet him. Amalgamate's too far away to pet. Oh, this is like the greater dog again. Oh, it's a dog with no face. Oh, what is that? Oh, what is it? Oh, it's firing arrows at me. Okay. Beckon, you call the amalgamate. It bounds towards you, flicking a strange liquid from an orifice. Ooh, oh god, it turned into a spaceship. Okay, okay, we're out of here. We're out of here. 
It's hovering close, looking for affection. Now, pet him. Pet the amalgamate. It convulses rapidly, then calms down. It rests quietly on your lap for a moment. Suddenly, it shoots away and crawls wildly on the walls. Okay. Okay. Oh, is this music speeding up? What the heck? It's striking the wall with its claws. Play? You throw your weapon into the corner of the room. The amalgamate brings it back to you. Proudly? You repeat this process a few times. Now amalgamate's very tired. It leans its dripping, amorphous body on you. Okay. Spaceship dog. With no face. The hole where his face is supposed to be. It's twitching affectionately. Okay. Uh... I oh, don't know why they do. Uh, do, do. Pet it again. You pet the amalgamate. It starts to generate a stage one happiness froth. Okay. This is a thing. This is a thing that's happening. I don't understand this. Amalgamate's convulsions intensify. I still can't spare it yet. Pet. You pet decisively. The amalgamate seems to be satisfied by all this. Oh. Okay, well, the music kind of returned to normal. And Dogony is contented. Oh, that's his real name. Oh, okay then. Well, I just don't even know what that was. Oh, okay. Let's just go back and pretend that that never happened. All right. Let's continue on. I need to find that green slot. Green slot has to be somewhere. Maybe it's down, down this way. Yeah, down this way with that face. No, I, th that's where I found the green key. This way. Yeah, there's another save slot, actually. And apparently this is a troll? Yep, I could have figured it was a troll. Smells like sweet lemons. Okay, this looks like, uh, this looks like Shiren. Or lemon bread. Okay. Hum, scream, flex, unhug, or cry. Let's just try all of it. Hum. You hum a familiar tune, lemon bread's body shakes. Welcome to my special hell. <laughs> Holy jeez, there's a lot of them. Oh! Why? Oh, I see. I see, I see how this works. Oh, yeah. Smells like sweet lemons. They keep humming? Okay, nothing else is happening. Stay here with me. I don't want to do that. I ain't staying here with you. Oh, jeez. Okay, I gotta get away from the, from the teeth before they, they hit me. Scream? You screamed out, but nobody came. That's what they all say. Okay. Go up here. Go this way. Oh, jeez. That was way too close. Ow. Uh, okay, let me try flexing. You flexed your arm. Lemon bread's muscle shakes. But nobody came. Why? Okay. This is a thing that's happening. Oh, I can leave his teeth. Okay. Fine then. Um. Just give me my star fate. Just be on the safe side. That's what they all say. Okay, just give me this attack right here. It's just gonna be this attack. Oh, jeez. Okay, there we go. Uh, how about I try unhugging him? You let Lemon Bread be. Lemon Bread seems to remember something. I felt this before. Uh. Hey! Uh. Holy jeez, how did I even... How did I even avoid that? Could this be goodbye? Yes, it is. Goodbye. Rest in peace. What is that thing, though? What does this say? DT extraction machine, status inactive. Okay, what about this room up here? Can I see what's in this room? Okay, this that's the yellow switch. There's a note on the ground. <coughs> oh my goodness gracious, almost blew my nose off. You can't make it all out. Under sheets. That's all you can read. Okay, what about the TV? There's a VHS player with a few tapes picked up beside it. They seem to be labeled in a specific order. Okay, there's five of them. Can I watch them? Psst. Gory, wake up. Hmm? What is it, dear? Er, and why do you have that video camera? Shush. I want to get your reaction. Okay, this sounds like Toriel and Azriel's voice. Or Asgore. Whatever. I know, is... Like, I don't know. I, I see some people refer to him as Asgore and other people as Azriel. Like, is Azriel... Supposed to be Asgore's real name or something? I, I don't know. Azriel, the king's son. Azriel, the king's son. The king's son. The king's son. Anyway. Gory, dearest, what is my favorite vegetable? Hmm. Carrots, right? 
No, no, no. My favorite vegetable is... Edamame. Get it? Go back to bed, dear. <laughs> no, no, not yet! Hehe. <laughs> now, if I were a dog, what breed of dog would I be? Hmm... I don't know, honey. What kind of dog would would you be? I would be a Mamaranian. Ho 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 ho. You sure are excited to have this child. You know, if you keep making jokes like this, one day you could be a famous Mamedian. Well, I am going to bed. Hey, come on, Tori. That one was funny. <laughs> I know. I'm just teasing you. Good night, dear. Good night, honey. Oh dear, perhaps it is too dark in here for the video to come out. Uh, okay. Can I... I guess we'll watch the tapes for now. I'll just see. Okay, Taylor, are you ready? What? Are, are you... What? Are you talking to me through the VHS? What? Do your creepy face. Ah! Hee hee hee. Oh, wait. Oh wait, this is... This is the character that talked to me after Undyne cut the bridge and I fell into the the trash area of uh, Waterfall. Yeah, I think this is the same voice. I had the lens cap on. What? You're not gonna do it again? Come on, quit tricking me. Haha. <laughs> okay. Who exactly is that, though? Tape 3? Howdy, Taylor. Smile for the camera. Uh, this time I got you. I left the cap on on purpose. Now you're smiling for no reason. Hehe. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, I remember. When we tried to make butterscotch pie for Dad, right? What? The recipe asked for cups of butter, but we accidentally put in butter cups instead. Yeah, those flowers got him really sick. I felt so bad. We made Mom really upset. I should have laughed it off like you did. Um, anyway, where are you going with this? Huh? Turn off the camera? Okay. Oh. Wait a second. Um... Is this- is this the child? Is this the... Asgore's child? Okay, I don't know what's happening right now. What is happening? I- I don't like this idea. W what N No, I'm not- Big kids don't cry. Y yeah, you're right. No, I never doubt you. Never. Y yeah we'll be strong. We'll be- f we'll free everyone. I'll go get the flowers. Okay. The last tape? Taylor, can you hear me? We want you to wake up. What? Toriel? And Asgore? You have to stay determined. You can't give up. You are the future of humans and monsters. Psst, Taylor, please, wake up. I don't like this plan anymore. I... I... No, I said... I said I'd never doubt you. Six, right? We just have to get six, and we'll do it together, right? Okay, um, this is, this is bizarre. Entry number four, I've been researching the humans to see if I can find any info about their souls. I ended up snooping around the castle and found these weird tapes. I don't feel like Asgore's watched them. I don't think he should. Oh. Okay, this is just getting really weird now. <laughs> I don't want to be in this place anymore. Entry number 19, the families keep calling me to ask when everyone's coming home. What am I supposed to say? I don't even answer the phone anymore. It's a refrigerator. It's empty. It seems to contain samples of some kind. Oh, the other one's shaking. Entry number 20. Asgore left me five messages today. Four about everyone being angry. One about this cute teacup he found that looks like me. Thanks, Asgore. Wait a second. I'm gonna avoid the one that's shaking for now. I spend all my time at the garbage dump now. It's my element. Okay... Don't know what's happening. Oh, here's a switch for the green. There we go. The green key fits perfectly into the slot. Okay, so now that's been put in there. There's a note on the ground. Can't make it all out. Curtain. Only could read. Okay. This one is just empty. Oh wait, that was that was the real one. Okay. What about the one that was shaking though? It's so cold. Oh. Snow Drake? Okay, Amalgamate. <laughs> laugh. You laugh and keep laughing. It's so funny you can't stop. Tears run down your face. What? 
You didn't do that? Snowy. Oh. Oh, Snowdrake can't even attack. Oh, uh, what happened to you? Heckle? You said something like, you look horrible. Why are you even alive? Wow, that's just a mean thing to say. What? You didn't say that? Snowy. Uh. Yeah, look at that. He can barely attack. What is going on with this music? You told a bad pun about snow. Her expression sh starts to shift. Uh, I remember. Not even trying. It's so cold. Told a bad pun about snow. Changes more. There we go. Oh yeah, she's starting to... Attack, kind of attack me. They just fell. And just joke. Told bad pun about snow. She's completely calmed down. Oh, that's it. Oh, and I got the blue key. Alright, give me the blue key here. There we go. So wait a second. There's, there's a refrigerator that was shaking here a while ago. It was this one, wasn't it? Yeah. Hello. It's empty. Okay, but why is it... It was shaking, though, wasn't it? I swear it was shaking. You were shaking, I know it. Yeah, see, you are shaking. Gotta be a reason for it. It says it's empty, though. Okay, then. <laughs> well, I guess we'll just go... We'll just go back for now. I think we'll go and put the... The blue key in, in its, uh... In its slot. And the last one I need to find is the yellow key. I think I have been recording for a very long time, but... I think what I'll try doing is that I'll try to find the... Uh, wait, it wasn't down this way. I think I'll try to find the uh, yellow key, and then after that I'll end the video off. I don't think I'll go into the uh, into the center, center door after I uh, find all the keys. Maybe I'll do that in the next part. So... Because I've been, I've been recording for quite some time now, but here we go. Click. Blue key fits perfectly into the slot. Now the last one I need to find is the yellow key. Let's go and find that. Hang on a second. This bed right here looks kind of out of place. There's something under the sheets. Sure. It's the yellow key. There you go. Put it on my keychain. I know exactly where to bring this, so give me a moment. Here we go. Put the yellow key in here. Nice, the yellow key fits perfectly. So now, the center door should open. So I'm gonna go back and see if the door is opened. Well, maybe I, I might at least go into the door before I end this video off. I just want to see if that works. Let's see. Let's go all the way back and see if that if that did something. I'm gonna walk back a, a little bit. Here we go. Yeah, we're back. This door should open now. I'm gonna save once again. The door does open. Alright. Let's go inside. Wait, there's an elevator? Seems like another elevator has lost its power. Okay. Oh, and we're back over this way. Oh wait, the things are not even coming on. Seems to be turned off. Okay. We'll just keep going. Okay, center, center room right here. What are we gonna have? I have a feeling it might be a boss fight. I don't know for sure, but I do have healing items, so... I think I'm, I think I'm fine for now. Let's see what we got. What exactly is this? It seems like this controls the elevator's power. Let's turn it on. Okay, that obviously did a bad thing. Yep. That definitely did a bad thing. Alright. Well, here we go, then. Boss fight? Hey, stop! Oh, it's Elphys. I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They get kind of sassy when they don't get fed on time. I think they smelled the potato chips you had, and... Anyway. The power went out, and I've been trying to turn it back on, but it seems like you were one step ahead of me. This was probably just a big inconvenience for you, but I appreciate that you came here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back. But that's not because of these guys or anything. I was just worried I would be too afraid to tell the truth. That I might run away or do something cowardly. Uh, I, I suppose I owe you an explanation. As you probably know, Asgore asked me to study the nature of souls. 
During my research, I isolated a power I called Determination. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls would last after death. But the experiment failed. You see, unlike humans, monsters' bodies don't have enough physical matter to take these concentrations of determination. Their bodies started to melt and lost what physicality they had. Pretty soon, all of the test subjects had melted had melted together into... those. Seeing them like this, I knew. I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't tell anyone about it. No matter how much everyone was asking me, and I was too afraid to do any more work, knowing... everything I'd done so far had been such a horrific failure. But now, now, I've changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I've done. It's going to be hard. Being honest, believing in myself. I'm sure there'll be times where I'll struggle. I'm sure there'll be times where I screw up again. But knowing, deep down, that I have friends to fall back on, I know it'll be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Come on, guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Okay. That wasn't a boss fight after all. Alrighty then. Well. Oh, the faces are happy now. Entry number eight. I've chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet because I want to surprise him with it. In the center of his garden, there's something special. The first golden flower that grew before all the others. The flower from the outside world. It appeared just before the queen left. I wonder. What happens when something without a soul gains the will to live? Entry number eighteen. The flower's gone. Oh! Is he talking about Flowey? Hmm. Oh, someone... Oh, whoa. Uh, that's not a good ring. It's a voice you have never heard before. Yep, this is bad. Wait, what? Taylor, are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? But you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. Taylor... See you soon. Uh, uh, okay. Why am I- Okay. Elevator's going back up, I guess. Oh. Vines? Uh, oh, there's no save point. Okay, what's going on? Uh, actually, no. Forget that. I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna take the elevator back. Hang on a second. Thing- Things are happening. Why are things happening? The elevator was blocked off by vines. But, but, but why though? <laughs> the heck's going on? Hang on. Are, are we at the end? Are we, are we gonna get the true pacifist ending? I don't know what's happening right now, but... Uh... Okay. I don't know what to do now, though. Uh... Okay. Yeah, the save- the save points are gone. But... Okay, this save point is still here, though. Um... What exactly do I do now? <laughs> I'm basically trapped here, I can't take the elevator back down to escape, so... Do I go- if I go in this room, am I just gonna fight Asgore again? Yeah, this is, so obviously I'm not supposed to go here. No. Yeah, this is the barrier, that's cool. If... Yeah, I have- I do have unfinished business, Asgore. Hang on a second. Yes, even reading something as small as Regan and Boker, taking a walk, please take your time. Hang on a second. Hang on a second, Asgore. Something ain't right here. Something isn't right. Uh, let's see here. Maybe I need to go back. Okay, so what exactly am I supposed to do? Because I can't go back, because the elevator is blocked off. So... What am I supposed to do? I'll, I'll figure this out here. Also, from this angle, it looks like Frisk has no arms. Am I the only one who sees that? The door is jammed shut with viands. I see. So what am I, what am I supposed to do here now? Maybe I'm just supposed to keep walking over this way and maybe it'll trigger something? Because if I go back to Asgore, he'll just- he'll just fight me. But is that- is that what I re really- do I have to fight him again? I don't know. How would I just walk through- walk through- through this again, and just- just to see what happens, if anything is different? Hmm. Maybe I do need to fight Asgore again, actually. There's no music playing now. This flower's still golden. 
Um, I see. Yeah, I already got the locket, actually. Is there a note? It's a note. How do you help yourself to anything you want? Uh... Okay, full of crumpled up recipes for butterscotch pie. What are the notes? Unopened containers of snails. White fur stuck in the drain. Um... So what exactly am I supposed to do now? Do I have to battle Asgore again, or... Did something change? No, these presents are opened. I've already opened them. This room is still under renovation, yeah. And there's this room. Actually, I didn't read this, did I? It's Asgore's journal. All the current page says is nice day today. The ink is still almost wet. Alright. It's just a chair. So what am I supposed to do now? Am I supposed to battle Asgore again? Maybe this time if I if I battle Asgore, maybe I'll get the true pacifist ending? I don't know. I am kind of confused right now. Well, nothing changed during uh, my walk back to the throne room, so... I guess we have to battle Asgore again, guys. <laughs> we have no choice. Alrighty then. I guess we'll, we'll just do it. Okay. Because I can't- I can't do anything else, so... Oh wait, his dialogue's different. Oh, back so soon. How are you feeling? Oh, okay, yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready to go. I, ca I can't seem to do anything else, so... I'm- I'm ready. I'm ready, Asgore. I'm ready for the- the terrible battle again. <laughs> this is it, then. Do I really need to battle you again? Am I ready? I guess so. Let's go. A strange light fills the room. Okay, yeah, his dialogue's different though. Twilight is shining through the barrier. Okay, yeah, it's this thing again. It seems your journey is finally over. I'm filled with determination. Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh, wait a second. Wait, what is that? Oh, uh, what? Toriel. What a miserable creature torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Do not be afraid, my child. It is I, Toriel, your friend and guardian. At first, I thought I would let you make your journey alone, but I could not stop worrying about you. Your adventure must have been so treacherous. And ultimately, it would burden you with a horrible choice. To leave this place, you would have to take the life of another person. You would have to defeat Asgore. However, I realized... I cannot allow that. It is not right to sacrifice someone simply to let someone leave here. Is that not what I've been trying to prevent this whole time? So, for now, let us suspend this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. Of course he does. Tori, you came back. Do not Tori me, dreamer. You pathetic whelp. If you really wanted to free our kind, you could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul, taken six souls from the humans, then come back and freed everyone peacefully. But instead, you made everyone live in despair, because you would rather wait here, meekly hoping another human never comes. Tori. You're right. I am a miserable creature. But, do you think we can at least be friends again? <sighs> no, Asgore. Oh, Undyne. Yeah, Asgore! Human! Nobody fight each other! Everyone's gonna make friends, or else I'll... I'll... Hello, I am Toriel. Are you the human's friend? It is nice to meet you. Uh, yeah? Nice to meet you! Hey, Asgore, is that your ex? Jeez, that's rough, buddy. <laughs> Elphas? Hey! Nobody hurt each other! Oh, are you another friend? I'm Toriel. Hello! Uh, uh hi! There's two of them? Papyrus! Hey, nobody fight anyone! If anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help! Hello! Oh, hello, your majesty! Psst! Hey, human! Did Asgore shave? And clone himself? <laughs> hey guys, what's up? That voice! Hello, I think we may know each other? Oh hey, I recognize your voice too! I'm Toriel. So nice to meet you. The name's Sans, and, uh, same. Oh, wait, then... This must be your brother, Papyrus. Greetings, Papyrus. It's so nice to finally meet you. 
Your brother has told me so much about you. Wowie, I can't believe Asgore's clone knows who I am! This is the best day of my life! Hey, Papyrus, what does the skeleton tile his roof with? Hmm, snowproof roof tiles? No, silly. A skeleton tiles his roof with... SHINGLES! <laughs> I changed my mind! This is the worst day of my life! Come on, Asgore, it's gonna be okay. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Y yeah, Asgore, Undyne's totally right about that fish thing. Sometimes you just gotta, uh, stop going after furry boss monsters and, uh, just get to know a really cute fish. It's a metaphor. Well, I think it's a good analogy. Oh my god! Will you two just smooch already? The audience is dying for some romantic action? Hey, shut up! Man, the nerve of that guy. Right, Elphys? Uh, Elphys? No. He's right. Let's do it. Huh? Well, uh, I, I guess if you want to, then? Don't hold anything back! <laughs> oh boy. W wait! Not in front of the human! Uh, right. Sorry, I got a little carried away there. Hee hee hee. My child, it seems as if you must stay here for a while. But looking at all the great friends you've made, I think... I think you'll be happy here. Hey, that reminds me. Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her. Uh, anyway, if I got here before you, how did you know how to call everybody? Let's just say... A tiny flower helped me. Papyrus, you made a huge mistake. A tiny... flower? Oh boy! Yep, yeah, Papyrus done goofed. Oh no. Flowey! <laughs> you idiots! While you guys were having your little powwow, I took the human souls! And now, not only are those under my power, but all of your friend's souls are gonna be mine too! Hee hee hee. And you know what the best part is? It's all your fault! It's all because you made them love you! All the time you spent listening to them, encouraging them, caring about them, without that, they wouldn't have come here. And now, with their souls and the humans together, I will achieve my real form. Hee <laughs> hee. Huh? Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game! If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game. If you win, you won't want to play with me anymore. And what would I do then? But this game between us will never end. I'll hold victory in front of you just within your reach, and then tear it away just before you grasp it. Over and over and over. <laughs> Listen, if you do defeat me, I'll give you your happy ending. I'll bring your friends back. I'll destroy the barrier. Everyone will finally be satisfied. But that won't happen. You! I'll keep you here no matter what. Well, I kicked your butt once, Flowey, so... I'll- I'll do it again, even if it means killing you one million times. Oh god. What? What? I can't move. I can't move! Why? Flowey, please! Oh no, you ain't. No, no! Someone help! Oh. What? Do not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, we will always be there to protect you. Oh. The- Oh! Papyrus! That's right, human. You can win. Just do what I would do. Believe in you. Hey, human, if you got past me, you can do anything, so don't worry. We're with you all the way. Huh? You haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on, this weirdo's got nothing on you. Technically, it's impossible for you to beat him, but somehow I know you can do it. Human, for the future of humans and monsters, you have to stay determined. Oh, well, even all the other monsters got my bag. Oh, and Muffet? And Froggit? Everyone else? No! Unbelievable! This can't be happening. You. You! I can't believe you're all so stupid. All of your souls are mine. Oh god, no. Flowey, please! Flowey, please! Is he gonna crash the game again? No? What the heck? Hello? Uh, I, I can't do anything. Um, oh wait, is that the child? 
Finally. I was so tired of being a flower. Oh. Howdy. Taylor. Are you there? It's me. Your best friend. Oh god. Azrael? Dreamer. Oh, this... Oh. This is Azrael. It's the end. Oh, okay then. Oh, okay. Now the entire game's tripping out. Okay. <laughs> I stopped recording just to go check something very quickly and suddenly this is happening. Okay, well. The, the acid's kicking in now. Um... Ezreal Dreamer. Oh, it's all rainbow. I don't want to kill. I don't want to kill. I have healing items. Let's go. Hope or dream. Hope? You held on to your hopes. You reduced how much damage you'll take this turn. What are you gonna do? Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. Stars. Stars. Stars are exploding everywhere. Holy jeez. Whoa. Hello. Don't know how I dodged that. Ezreal charges Shocker Breaker. Okay. Can I dream? You think about why you're here now. Oh wait, that healed me. You can feel the empty space in your inventory get smaller and smaller. You know, I don't care about destroying this world anymore. Uh Oh, I have to stay in the... Stay in the center. Oh, jeez! It's supposed to dodge that, Chaos Saber. Okay, just keep healing, perhaps. After I defeat you and gain total control over the timeline, I just want to reset everything. Won't let you... Why? Okay. Okay. Go... No, stay on the other side. Okay, then. Wow. Well, this is a thing that's happening right now. All your progress, everyone's memories. I'll bring them all back to zero. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. I just gotta... I just gotta... Oh, jeez. It's so hard to dodge, though. That's the problem. Then we can do everything all over again. Okay. We're just... Doing this... Doing the... The, ex, the star explosions. Okay. Yeah, hi. Oh, okay. It didn't hurt me too badly. Chaos Buster. Can I just dream? Your items fill up with dreams. Wait, what? What does that mean? And you know what the best part of all this is? You'll do it! it. Oh, wow. Y you have a shotgun, apparently. Nope. Nope, just keep moving. Keep moving! There we go. No, 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 no! Okay, there we go. Wait, Chaos Saber. Chips? Wait, Last Dream? What is Last Dream? Through determination, the dream came true, your HP was maxed out. Okay, then you'll lose to me again. No, I'm not gonna lose to you again. Uh, uh, okay, move that way. Don't move that way. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, I did lose. Great. Oh, wait a second! But I refused! Hang on a second, I ain't dead just yet! I ain't dead just yet! Wait a second. Maybe I just do it again. Okay, wait a second, I, I didn't die, though. It, it just reset to the- it just reset back to the beginning of the fight, I think. My soul refuses to die! Yeah, but I think- I think the dialogue reset, though, so now I need to- I need to listen to him again. Or maybe I don't have to, I don't- I don't really know. You're not gonna take my soul! No! Holy jeez. <laughs> okay, I won't let you. I will not let you. I won't let you. Okay. Okay. I gotta go in the same direction that that Ezreal is is going in. Okay, ready, ready your chaos, Buster. Last dream. The dream came to the dream. The dream came true. Jeez. And again. Okay, watch out. Holy jeez. Please, enough with your shotgun. Nope. There you go. There you go. I really like this music, by the way. I really like it. And again! Eh, eh, no, uh, oh boy. Oh jeez. Oh, it's so fast. Just move. Move out of the way. Holy jeez. Oh boy. The dream came true. Because you want a happy ending. And I will get the happy ending. You won't stop me! You won't stop me! 
Oh, jeez. Holy jeez. I don't want to keep healing, for goodness sakes. I want to try dreaming again, because you love your friends. Okay, where are you going to move? Nope. You're moving that way. Just follow your move- follow his movements, her movements, I don't- I don't know. Get out of the way, please. Can I dream? Your items fill up with dreams, there we go. Because you never give up. And I won't- I won't give up! I'll never give up! I'll never do it! I'll never do it! I won't! I won't! And even if I do die, I think I'll just come back, so- oh, jeez! Okay, you need the dreams. Dream came true. Isn't that delicious? Your determination. The power that let you get this far. It's gonna be your downfall. I don't think it will! Oh, wow. You just can't. You just can't. Oh, wow. Avoided all of it like a pro. Got a dream. Now, enough messing around. It's time to purge this timeline once and for all. Whoa, what's going on? Whoa! What the heck? Wait, why is there a green? Why is it- Oh, oh no! No, I need to get away! Oh god, get away from it. Get away from it. No! No! I'm still alive. Even after that attack, you're still standing in my way? Wow, you really are something special, but don't get cocky. Up until now, I've only been using a fraction of my real power. Let's see what good your determination is against this! Uh-oh. What's happening? Oh! Oh, here we go. Oh, wait, I can only act! I can only act! Uh, uh, okay, I can only act. Like, I, I can't choose anything else, it won't let me. Oh no, I gotta struggle. Can't move your body. Ah, behold my true power! Oh, uh, boy. Ho! Oh. Okay, well, that, that hit me. But hang on, I ain't, I ain't done just yet. Oh, wait, my HP's back. Okay, I can feel it. Every time you die, your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. Your life will end here in a world where no one remembers you. No, that ain't gonna happen, Flowey. What are you even attacking me with? What is this? The whole world is ending. Can't move my body. Still, you're hanging on? That's fine. In a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. That attitude will serve you well in your next life. Oh god, I need to destroy you, Flowey. I will destroy you! I won't! I won't give up! I can't move my body. Still, come on, show me what good your determination is now. Oh boy. Hey boy! Hey buddy! Darn it! I'm not giving up just yet. Wait, do I have to... Wait, can't move your body, nothing happened. You struggle, nothing happened. You tried to reach your save file, nothing happened. You tried again to reach your save file, and nothing happened. Seems saving the game really is impossible. But, maybe, with what little power you have, you can save something else. Oh! I can save- Oh! I can save whoever I want? Uh, well, I'm at full health, so save Undyne. We reached out to Azrael's soul and called out to your friends. They're in there somewhere, aren't they? Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. The lost soul appeared. Oh, here we go. Fake hit, recipe, smile, or clash. Uh, okay, I can I can do other stuff, but, uh, recipe? You asked a lost soul to teach you how to cook. She doesn't know why, but she kind of wants to teach you how. All humans will die. Oh, it's just this again. Oh, okay. I see. The lost soul stands there. Smile? You gave the lost soul a big smile like you remember she likes to do. For some reason, she sort of wants to smile back. You're a real enemy. I don't think so. Oh, there- oh, 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 oh! Can't do it! Okay, there we go. The Lost Soul stands there. Clash? You clashed against the Lost Soul with all your might. She recognizes your fighting spirit. Suddenly, memories are flooding back. Well, some humans are okay, I guess. There we go. I saved Undyne. Time to save Elphys. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. Here we go. She's still wearing her dress. Encourage. You tell the lost soul that you'll continue to support her. Something about the way you said that is familiar to her. You hate me, don't you? Uh, no I don't. Oh, it's just Metaton. Metaton, please, go away. This isn't your fight. Call? You call the lost soul on the phone. She starts to sweat. She doesn't know why, 
But this all seems very familiar. We gotta keep lying. Uh, okay, this is just Metaton's attacks all over again. There we go. Nerd out, you asked the lost soul what her favorite cartoon is. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. No, that's not true. My friends like me, and I like you too. There we go. Let's save Papyrus next. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. Oh, it's Sans and Papyrus. Joke? You told the lost soul a bad pun about skeletons. He seems to hate it. But the other lost soul seems to like it. I must capture a human! Just give up. I did. Oh, here we go. Yeah, by the way, when I fought Papyrus back in, like, part, part 3, I didn't realize you could still move around when you were blue. So... Yeah, sorry for being an idiot during that fight, by the way. You asked the Lost Soul for help with a puzzle. He doesn't know why, but he really wants to help you. Everyone will. Why even try? Oh! Hey! Ow. Nah, this is just Papyrus' attacks over and over again. It's fine. Recipe. You asked the Lost Soul to cook something for you. The Lost Soul is trying to hide its joy. You'll never see him again. Oh, I'll see Papyrus again. I'll see you too, Sans. Oh, jeez. Oh! Okay, there we go. Insult? Can I tell another joke? Bad pun about skeletons. Suddenly, its memories are flooding back. Seeing how nicely you treated its brother, the other lost soul remembers too. No, wait! You're my friend! I can never capture you. Nah, I'm rooting for you, kid. Okay, Sans and Papyrus have been saved. Toriel, let's go. Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. The lost souls appeared. Oh, here we go. Toriel and Asgore. Talk? You tell the lost soul that you have to go if you're going to free everyone. Something is stirring within her. This is for your own good, forgive me for this. Oh, it's just this again. This isn't- no, this isn't bad. This attack's not bad. Apparently the hand itself does not- does not hurt me. Mercy? You refuse to fight the lost soul. Something about this is so familiar to her. No one will leave again. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna avoid this as much as I can. There we go, I'm really getting the hang of these attacks now. Maybe talk again? Tell the lost soul that you have to go if you're going to free everyone. Okay, something is stirring. Not exactly free just yet, though. Come on here. This ain't over just yet. Hug the lost soul and tell her that you're going to see her again. Suddenly, her memories are flooding back. Seeing her remember you, the male lost soul tried hard to remember you, too. Your fate is up to you now. You're future. You feel your friend's souls resonating within Ezreal. Save someone else? Strangely, as your friends remembered you, something else began resonating within the soul, stronger and stronger. It seems that there's still one last person that needs to be saved. The child, but who? Suddenly, you realize. You reach out and call their name. Huh? What are you doing? Oh wait. It's me. Oh, hang on. You feel your friend's souls resonating within Azrael. I need to save Azrael. What did you do? What's this feeling? What's happening to me? Okay, so... Okay, I was wrong about that, so no. As Asgore's real name is not Azriel. That's... I think Azriel is the name of the child. No. No. I don't need anyone. God. Oh my god. Ugh. I'm still alive. Do I just get the last dream? Dream came true. Stop it! Get away from me! Do you hear me? I'll tear you apart. Here we go. Oh, that's not too bad. That's not bad at all. There we go. Save you. Do you know why I'm doing this? Why I keep fighting to keep you around? Oh, okay. The attacks are not hitting me. I'm doing this because you're special. You're the only one that understands me. You're the only one who's any fun to play with anymore. Okay. It's not attacking me anymore, so... No. That's not just it. I... I... I'm doing this because I care about you. I care about you more than anybody else. I'm not ready for this to end. I'm not ready for you to leave. 
I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. So, please, stop doing this, and just let me win! No. Ah! Uh, why, 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 why? What? I can't move! Stop it! Stop it! Ah! Uh, stop it now! I can't, I can't do anything else. <laughs> My health is not going down, and all I can do is save. I'm so alone. Oh, the music's fading out. I'm so afraid. I... I... There we go. I think he's back to normal now. I'm so sorry. I always was a crybaby, wasn't I? I know. You're not actually Taylor, are you? Taylor's been gone for a long time. Wait, what? Um... What- what is your name? Frisk? That's... a nice name. Oh! Frisk. I haven't felt like this for a long time. As a flower, I was soulless. I lacked the power to love other people. However, with everyone's souls inside me, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel every other monster's as well. They all care about each other so much, and... They care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you how everyone feels about you. Papyrus, Sans, Undyne, Elphiz... Toriel... Monsters are weird. Even though they barely know you, it feels like they all really love you. Haha. <laughs> Frisk, I... I understand if you can't forgive me. I understand if you hate me. I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. I'll forgive him. W what? Frisk, come on. You're... You're gonna make me cry again. Besides, even if you do forgive me, I can't keep these souls inside of me. The least I can do is return them. But first, there's something I have to do. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire, with everyone's power, with everyone's determination. It's time for monsters to finally go free. Okay. So is he... Oh, alright, there's, there's the souls, there's all the other hearts. Oh. The barrier was destroyed. Frisk. I have to go now. Without the power of everyone's souls, I can't keep maintaining this form. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower. I'll stop being myself. I'll stop being able to feel love again. So, Frisk, it's best if you just forget about me, okay? Just go be with the people who love you. Just comfort him. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I don't want to let go. Frisk, you're... you're going to do a great job, okay? No matter what you do. Everyone will be there for you, okay? Well, my time's running out. Goodbye. By the way, Frisk, take care of Mom and Dad for me, okay?
Frisk. This is all just a bad dream. Please, wake up. Oh, you are awake. Thank goodness. We were so worried. It felt like you were out forever. Yeah, any longer and I would have freaked out. Tell us next time you decide to take a nap, okay? Yeah, you made Papyrus cry like a baby. What? I didn't cry! I don't cry! I just caught something in my eye. What did you catch? Tears! <laughs> now, now. The important part is that Frisk is alright. Here, Frisk. Why not drink some tea? It'll make you feel better. Er, how about we give them space first? They must be very exhausted. Though, from what? I'm not certain. Frisk, we do not remember exactly what happened. There was a flower, and then... Everything went white. But now the barrier is gone. When you are ready, we will all return to the surface. It seems the door to the east will lead us there now. But before then, perhaps you might want to take a walk? You can say goodbye to all your wonderful friends. Do as you wish. We will all wait for you here. Let's just talk to all of them. Hello, Frisk. Elf has upgraded my phone. In. I'm having a lot of fun with the texting feature. Sans, check out this one. Oh man, Tori. That's brutal. I can't believe the queen has returned. And also that she's a huge dork. You two are two feet away from each other. Why are you texting? Worry not, Papyrus. We are texting for a good reason. Why is that? Well, because we're huge dorks. Sans, please do not say that. You are not a dork. You are more of a bonehead. <laughs> ah, wow! Those puns are even less funny coming from her. Then why are you smiling? It's a pity smile. Hey, Frisk. What's with that weird expression? Sans, did I tell you about the time Frisk flirted with me? And then asked to call me mother? Oh boy. Wow, Frisk. This really puts our relationship in a new light. Hey, Tori. Do you have any other embarrassing stories? Oh, do I ever, but I think that story is one of the most unbelievable. It is hard to think anyone would want to flirt with me. <laughs> oh, Toriel. You have no idea. Papyrus? So, Asgore, how about making me a member of the Royal Guard? Well, Papyrus, now that the war is over, we might not need the Royal Guard anymore. What? Then what was the point of the human's quest? They journeyed all that way, and I'm still not a member of the Royal Guard? Truly, this is the worst possible ending. So, Elf is, what do you want to do now that we're all free? We have the whole world to explore now. Well, of course I'm gonna go out and... Um... No, I should be honest. I'm gonna stay inside and watch anime like a total loser. That's the spirit. Everyone, a celebration to being losers. Heh, <laughs> Papyrus has the right idea. Losing the Frisk is the best thing that ever happened to me, so I'm glad that we... Huh? What is it, Asgore? Um... What's an... Anime? Oh my god. Frisk, please. Help me explain what anime is to Asgore. Y you see, it's like a cartoon, but... Uh, with, with, with swords. So it's like a cartoon, but with swords? Golly. That sounds neato. Where is this? Where can I see the anime? Uh, hold on. Uh, I think I have some on my phone. Here, look at this. Oh, uh, um, that's the, that, that's the wrong, uh, 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 never mind. Golly. Were those two robots... kissing? Boy. Technology sure is something, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it sure is. Psst, Frisk. Um, y you've gotta tell me. D do you think Asgore and Toriel are, uh, never gonna get back together? Uh, maybe. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what I hope too. Just think about how cute they must have been together. It's quickly becoming my number one ship of all time, Tori and Gory. My my old boss and his ex-wife. Uh, that sounds a lot less cool all of a sudden. Howdy, Frisk. Sorry about almost trying to take your soul. I feel very bad about it. 
I hope we can still be pals. Hey, no worry about it, Asgore. I think everybody's tried to kill Frisk at least once. Oh, I see. In that case, I'm not sorry, Frisk. Asgore? That's not what I meant. Okay then. Well, I can go down this way. Is there anything down here for me to see? Oh yeah, this is the, the room. So I can just go back? Could, exp could I explore the rest of the area before uh, ending ending the game for good? I guess I can, but uh, I, I don't I don't think I will for now. But yeah, there you go, guys. That's uh, that's the true pacifist ending, I believe. And wow, that's uh, it's quite the ending. So yeah. I am speechless, I really, I really am, because... So, apparently, the fallen human that I named was not the actual human I was controlling at all. It was Frisk. So... This child is... This child's real name is Frisk, so... Because I named him Taylor after my real name, but apparently, I wasn't actually controlling him because... The real human had been gone for a while. But I was controlling Frisk this whole time. I see. Or something like that, but... Oh, goodness. Yeah. I, I really enjoyed playing this game. This is definitely one of my most favorite games of all time. That that final boss... Couldn't couldn't even couldn't even die to it. I wouldn't, I wouldn't let him kill me. I would not let him kill me. But... Yeah, I just... I just love this game so much. I really do. This is... This is definitely... This is definitely one of my most favorite games of all time. I mean, it's... Of course, it's not my most favorite game ever made, but it's definitely... It's definitely one of my most favorite RPGs and just one of my most favorite games of all time. That was that was awesome. I really enjoy playing this game. I'm, I'm really glad I decided to play this game for myself. I tried to avoid looking up as much information about this game as possible, just because I didn't want to spoil the ending for myself, so... Yeah, I, I really enjoyed, I really enjoyed playing this. Now, of course, I'm not done with Undertale just yet, because I still need to do the Genocide run, which... I think after, after getting this ending, I am going to absolutely hate doing, because that means I have to kill everyone. But... We're, we're done for now. I think, uh... We, we talked to all of them, so... We just gotta go through this room... And it'll, it'll all be over. The pacifist run... Of Undertale... Will be done. Let's go through. If you leave here, your adventure will really be over. Your friends will follow you out of the underground. Well, I mean... I could go back and, and look at all the uh, areas we explored, but... I mean, we, we will be returning to them in the genocide run, so... You know what? I'm ready. I'm ready to leave. I think I've seen everything I've wanted to see. I mean, knowing this game, there's still probably a lot of stuff that I missed, but... I'm, I'm okay with it. I'll just leave. Here we go. Oh my. Isn't it beautiful, everyone? Wow, it's it's even better than on TV. Way better, better than I ever imagined. Frisk, you live with this? The sunlight is so nice and the air is so fresh. I really feel alive. Hey Sans, what's that giant ball? We call that the sun, my friend. That's the sun? Wowie! I can't believe I'm finally meeting the sun! I could stand here and watch this for hours. Yes, it's beautiful, is it not? But we should really think about what comes next. Oh, right. Everyone, this is the beginning of a bright new future. An era of peace between humans and monsters. Frisk, I have something to ask of you. Will you act as our ambassador to the humans? Be the ambassador? Sure. Yeah, Frisk will be the best ambassador. And I, the great Papyrus, will be the best mascot. I'll go make a good first impression. And he's gone. Well, someone's gotta keep him from getting into trouble. See you guys. Um, Sans is gone too. Man, do I have to do everything? Papyrus, wait! Hey, Undyne, wait up! Whoops. 
Can I... Can I move? No, I can't. Uh, should I do something? Well, gotta go. It seems that everyone is quite eager to set off. Frisk, you came from this world, right? So you must have a place to return to, do you not? What will you do now? I want to stay with you or I have places to go. Okay, what do I choose here? You know what, I'm not gonna say I have places to go because that would just be sad. I want to stay with you. What? Frisk, you really are a funny child. If you had said that earlier, none of this would have happened. It is a good thing you took so long to change your mind. Hehe. <laughs> well, I suppose. If you really do not have any other place to go, I will do my best to take care of you for as long as you need. Alright? Now come along. Alright. Here we go. Everyone is waiting for us. And there we go. That's that's the uh, end of Undertale. That's the true credits, I guess. Also, this is the uh, battle music, but it's just slowed down a little bit. Yeah, there's the cast of all the uh, the uh, characters. Yeah, all the uh, monsters. Froggen and Wimson. Professional frog, braver every day. Mold small, backup dancer, looks, reform bully. Vegetoid, popular nutritionist. Migos, casually enjoys life. Naps to look by Toby. Okay, I guess it's, uh... I guess it's like saying, uh, who designed the monsters. Oh, spooky DJ. Oh, what is this? Oh, Papyrus. Was designed by Toby and Temi. And Sans was just designed by Toby. <laughs> Uh, okay, then. <laughs> Sans just cut him off. Okay, then. Cruising down the highway, Papyrus. <laughs> There's Snow Drake. Snow Drake and Ice Cap. Still looking for laughs, thinking about its hat. Gift Rod and Doggo. Finding peace and quiet as his own seeing eye dog. Dogami and Duressa. Finally, number one nose nozzle champions. Actually, some of the text is yellow, while other text is white. Uh, maybe, maybe if uh, oh, maybe because I didn't, I didn't spare them. That's maybe that's why. Because I forgot to spare them. Uh, well, then <laughs> that's okay. What is what is Undyne do? Oh. What? 9,999? <laughs> okay. Well, they finally kissed. Well, on the cheek, anyway. Aaron, designed by Temi, reluctantly. Alright, well, anyway. Yeah, that that is it for the pacifist run of Undertale. So, we got we got the true pacifist run. We, we, got, the tr we got the true pacifist ending, I mean. So, yeah, I, I really enjoyed that. But, like I said, we're not done with Undertale just yet, because I still need to do the... I still need to do the genocide run. But you know what? I think for now I will just take a break from making, uh... From making videos of Undertale for a while. For just just a little while. And, uh... Maybe in the next uh, couple of weeks or so I'll get started on the genocide run. I did hear people say that the genocide run is supposed to be very difficult. But... I'll, I'll, I'll find a way. I'll, I'll find a way to... To get through it. So... Anyway... I guess, uh, I don't really have anything else to say, so I guess I'll just let you guys, uh, watch the credits, and I'll just shut up for now. Stop trying to... Stop rambling, because I don't have anything else to say. That's it for Undertale. It was a great game, I really enjoyed it, I'm really happy that I decided to play it for myself, and this is definitely one of my most favorite RPGs of all time. The characters are hilarious, for one thing, especially Papyrus. Papyrus is just... just amazing. Anyway... Those are all the uh, other monsters that I that I fought, so... I'll leave this video here, and next time, when we return to Undertale, we will be doing the... Genocide Run. Which I'm probably going to hate doing, but... If I want to, uh... If I want to complete the entire game, then I'll have to do it, so... There's, uh... There's Asgore. Oh yeah, there's, there's Papyrus' face. Or his head. Oh, school? Okay, the, the monster kid's going to school. 
Well, alrighty then. Oh wait, what is... The mountain's in color now. Ah, oh, I see. And there it is! The end. Well, oh, 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 wait. Hang on a second. Weird things are happening. What? Y Excuse me? I thought I destroyed you. Ha 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 ha. Did you really think it was over? I mean, we haven't even done the special thanks yet. Ready? Let's end all of this for good. Wait, special thanks? Oh, I have infinite HP? Wait, what am I doing? Oh. Uh... What, what am I supposed to do here? Oh, am I supposed to let these things hit me or something? Uh, okay, I don't know what's happening right now, but... Uh, okay. Um... There's a lot of special thanks, holy jeez. Um, am I supposed to be running into these things, or am I supposed to be avoiding them? I don't even know, actually. I'm not- I'm not really sure, but... They're- they're not doing anything to me, they're not damaging me, because I have infinite HP, so... Oh, maybe I'm- maybe I am supposed to avoid them, actually. Follow the path. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I have a feeling I'm supposed to avoid them, actually, so maybe... Maybe just try to avoid them best I can, darn it. Oh boy. Oh jeez, get in! Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. We're just... just scrolling upwards. Hit! There. Avoid the credits, avoid... avoid getting wrecked by the credits. Oh jeez, got the spinning wheels. Spinning wheels, oh boy. Oh boy, ow, ow, I'm hitting things. I'm hitting things. Okay, just stay in here, oh. Okay, oh, 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 darn it. This is so hard. Oh, oh, I made it, I made it through somehow. Okay, yeah, they're gonna- they're gonna get fired at me. Okay, yeah. I think I do have to avoid this. Oh god, nope, that's- that's doing the bad. That's doing a bad right there. Oh, jeez. <coughs> oh my goodness. You know, I've been talking for so long in this video that, uh... My- my voice is starting to... I'm starting to lose my voice a little bit. My throat's starting to hurt, I mean. Yeah. Well, I wasn't- I wasn't originally intending on making this, uh, the last video. Or, I mean, like, the finale to the pacifist run, but... I decided to just... Finish it once and for all. Why not? Just do it all in just one part. Just, uh, finish the rest of the game. There you go. Thanks to friends and family for supporting us, Undertale teams. Thanks to you, the player, from the bottom of our hearts. Without you, all of this would be impossible. Good night. There you go. Is that it? Actually, hang on, we still... My heart is still here. Oh. Okay, it's gone. Oh, wait a second. Oh, Toriel. Okay, yeah, because we're living with her now. There you go. Just give me the butter butterscotch pie. Can I can I move during the sequence? Like if when she closes the door okay, I guess not. Because it just just goes to black. Undertale! One of the best RPGs ever made, without a doubt. Really enjoyed it. Okay, well, anyway. And, uh, is there nothing else I can do here? If I just press Z, will it go back to the... to the end now, or press Enter? Okay, no, actually, it's, it's not doing anything. So, alright, well, I guess I'll end it here, guys, so... There's still a uh, bit more stuff we could do at, during the uh, the credits, trying to avoid all the the names flying at me, which I uh, I think I think you were supposed to avoid the names, but I, I really don't think it would have mattered because I had like infinite HP. So, oh wait a second, there's a dog. There's the uh, <laughs> the dog right here. Um, how you doing? Just slowly walking across the screen. All right, well. I guess that's it. We're done with the pacifist run, guys. We got the true ending. But like I said, we're not done just yet because next we need to do the genocide run, which I will be doing for now. But I think for now I will take a short break from Undertale. And in the next couple of weeks or so, we'll get started on the genocide run. Anyway, that'll be it for me. I think this might have been like one of the longest 
longest videos I've ever uploaded to YouTube, but... I'm, I am, I am gonna keep, uh, all of this in just, in just one part. I'm not gonna, like, split this into two parts or anything. This all will just be one gigantic video. It will. But it's, like, almost two hours long. I've been recording... Like, I started recording at, like... I, I think, like, three o'clock, and it's already, like, 5.30, so... Holy jeez. Didn't think I'd be recording for that long, but... I did it. We're done. Anyway. Doesn't look like I can do anything else on this screen, so... Yeah, I don't know if I have to, like, close the game now, or... Oh, okay, the dog's asleep now. Alright, well, I don't know if I have to close the game in order to, uh, completely reset it, but... Yeah, the dog's, the dog's asleep now, I don't, I don't really know what else to do, so... Anyway, I'll just end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed the, uh, pacifist run of Undertale. This is definitely one of the best RPGs ever made. I really enjoy playing this, but... Not done just yet, we need to do the genocide run next, and I'm gonna absolutely hate doing it, because that means I have to kill all of the characters in this game that I just love. So, that's gonna, that's gonna be just awful. But, we have to do it if we wanna truly complete the game, I guess, so. Anyway, I'm done for now. If you wanna purchase Undertale, link's in the description. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video I make. Later. Wait a second. I started the game back up. I decided to quit the game because I couldn't do anything else on the end screen, but when I started back the game up, Flowey is here. Hi. Seems as if everyone is perfectly happy. Monsters have returned to the surface. Peace and prosperity will rule across the land. Take a deep breath. There's nothing left to worry about. Well, there is one thing. One last threat. One being with the power to erase everything. Everything everyone's worked so hard for. You know who I'm talking about, don't you? That's right. I'm talking about you. You still have the power to reset everything. Toriel, Sans, Asgore, Elphis, Papyrus, Undyne. If you so choose, everyone will be ripped from this timeline and sent back before all of this ever happened. Nobody will remember anything. You'll be able to do whatever you want. That power. I know that power. That's the power you were fighting to stop, wasn't it? The power that I wanted to use. But now, the idea of resetting everything. I... I don't think I could do it all again. Not after that. So please, just let them go. Let Frisk be happy. Let Frisk live their life. But, if I can't change your mind, if you do end up erasing everything, you have to erase my memories, too. I'm sorry. You've probably heard this a hundred times already, haven't you? Well, that's all. See you later. Yeah. I am going to absolutely hate doing the genocide run of this game, now that I've completed the pacifist run. But, if I want to truly complete the game, it has to be done. And the title screen is different too. No characters, not even Toriel. And we just have this really weird ambience in the background. I am gonna hate doing... <laughs> I'm gonna hate doing the genocide run, but it has to be done, so... I'll see you in the next couple of weeks when we do the genocide run of Undertale. As much as I don't want to do it, but if we want to truly complete the game, it has to be done. Anyway, this is it for me for now, so later, guys.